hi everyone welcome back to my channel curiosity unlimited uh, today i have some uh, weighing scales that i'm going to uh, test so i have a analog one which is quite old this one it's around 2016-17 then i have uh, one uh, new one which is a digital uh, weighing scale and i have one kitchen weighing scale which is also a digital one so we're going to put these three scales to the test and see which one gives a better or Sim, uh, you know, uh, quite close to the accurate result. So let's get started. Let's open this uh, first. This is quite old. I have already used it many times. So this is Eagle brand mechanical personal scale Eon series. It had 24 months warranty. Maximum capacity 130 kgs. Okay. So this is a classic. Uh, you know scale analog and there is a uh, you know what is this called regulator to you know make it like uh, more accurate okay so I'm just going to put it at zero and let's wait this laughing with the Okay, so it's probably not even you know. Uh, let me just turn it around. Not visible from there, but if you see it from here, it's not even you know like it's not even around. Two, three hundred grams maybe as per this weighing scale so we can't get get an accurate result so let's move on to the digital one so this is the digital scale that i've ordered from amazon let's open this I will need a knife okay I got something to help now let's open this let's see what we have got here This is Health Genie Digital Personal Weighing Scale. Okay, it is a digital one. It has high precision strain gauge sensors or auto on off, tempered glass platform, display room temperature, anti skid platform. Alright, there's this scratch activate warranty and get a chance to win treadmill worth 75,000. Okay, worth trying. Place your scale on a flat surface for most accurate result. Okay, okay, okay. Calibrate the scale. It's a brushed black color. Okay, this is the MRP of it. I'm, I have got it for around 700, 800 rupees. I'll put the link in the description. If you consider buying it, then please click on that link. Uh, you will not be charged anything extra, but I may get some, uh, you know, support for my channel from that. 
ports in the back. Okay, there are some USB scales, there are body fat analyzers, fiber wing scales. So there are multiple things that this company sells and this is the, uh, you know, specifications of just the load capacity, 180 kg platform size, there's graduation 50 grams, low battery indicator, large LCD display and overload indicator. So if it goes above 180, it will show an overload indicator. So let's open this now. <clears throat> scale there's nothing in the box there's this warranty card okay it's a warranty card and probably some manual okay i opened it upside down there are two batteries included AAA batteries that this wing scale takes okay the user manual is here and this is a nice glass platform I'm not sure if it's anti skid or not but it is definitely glass this is the display So let me put the batteries in now. This is where the batteries go. Okay, the batteries are in. There is some instructions here in case using the scale for the first time and moving the scale. Please stand on the scale to initiate and step off. The scale is now auto calibrated and ready to use. Okay, okay, let's just see if it starts automatically if we put weight on it. Okay, yep, it does start. So let's just check the weight of this now. low it's switched off it's not getting initiated with the weight of this I'm just try my hand yep started now if i keep this okay it's showing 60 grams but the weight is too less and it's getting switched off sixty grams the weight for this is showing at 60 0.60 kg which is 600 grams so it's definitely a better option instead of the analog one because that just shows that it is like 100 200 grams see if it, it if if i pick it up it doesn't switch on but if i keep it down it switches on if i put the weight it shows 60 which goes to 600 grams it shows room temperature it shows the battery these are the three things that it shows and it's a point as well so it's taking the decimal value as well now let this keep let's just keep this aside and start opening the third okay there's just one more thing i realized that if you want to manually switch it on you can do it by pressing a button see it's switched on without keeping the weight this is the button here if you press it it manually switches on so when you stand on it this button gets pressed and that is the reason it uh, switches on the uh, scale 
so right now see it's off just and the camera angle is not getting proper see it's switched off right now i press this button and switches on now it is showing the weight in pounds so i don't know how to change that so it is showing lb now it is showing stlb now it is showing kg now it is again showing lb so lb i know pounds what is stlb i don't know if you know please uh, let me know in the comments so if you press this button it goes to kg again okay great let's just get to the third one Okay, this is the third one that I have. This I had it from a long time, but I have maybe used it once. I don't even remember. So this is the um, all the options which are available. The specifications are here. You know the size and everything. So if anyone wants, they can take a screenshot and or rather pause the video and check it out. Uh, Thank you for joining environment. Okay, not legal trade. Okay, okay. Let's just open. Some thermocol, please. There's nothing else in the box. Okay. This is a bowl that we've got with it. It's a 1200 ml bowl. <coughs> You can use to weigh. Okay, there are some things here that we missed out. This is the instruction sheet. This is add extra six months warranty. These are all the products available with them. And this is a warranty card. All right. This is the actual scale now this is the cutest you know scale out of all three i mean the glass one is nice definitely but this one is very cute small and cute because it's a kitchen scale so it has to be now just keep it like this okay so let's just first switch it on oh it, it, it will need battery yeah okay let me just put the battery in uh, batteries are actually included in it uh, just that i've used it earlier i don't remember where i've kept the batteries so i'm just going to keep use the other one okay. it has a backlight it has started it shows 1 ml 2 ml 9 ml because it's moving the weight is actually not proper so if i just keep my finger on it okay now we can change the unit this is ounce this is pounds this is grams and this is ml so there are four kind of units the light is gone now so let's just put it on grams okay it's came back when you put weight it comes back and this so this is off this is on and then there's tear tear whatever tare, whatever you call it it's to make sure that when you are on a flat surface you want to calibrate it back to zero you press it it shows zero if i keep something on it it will show the weight of that if i press tear now it's again zero so anything i put now on it will be calculated it will not calculate the size the weight of the bowl so just keep this thermocol see what it is okay it does not even have one gram 
Okay. Now, if I have to put this, I will let go in the bowl. Yes, it goes in the bowl. It shows 593, which is approximately accurate because that shows 0. 0.60 and this is showing 593. So there's only two decimals. So 590 is getting 60, which is quite accurate. So I okay. If you just check it in other unit 592, it's showing a one gram less, which is fine. It shows it. It is. It has a graduation of one gram. 592 ml 592 grams is same it's 20.9 ounce and 13 point sorry 1.304 pounds okay good just take it out it's a pen holder by the way it's, that looks nice so that's it for the day guys so these were the three scales that i had to show you so if you have liked the video please uh, click the like button and if you have enjoyed watching it please subscribe to the channel uh check the links in the description for the scales uh, so the analog one i don't have link because it's a manual purchase but the other two i have links i'll share it below thank you for watching guys have a great day